you ever eaten a painting? Here it is, the traditional Chinese folk art, sugar painting. Spoon as pen, liquid sugar as ink. Everything in the world can be sketched through the stroke. It is said that Chen Ziang, a great poet in the 7th century, liked to eat brown sugar. But he ate it in a unique way. Melt the sugar on a clean and smooth table, and cast it into various shapes of small animals. After cooling down, it could be held in the hand, eaten, and enjoyed. Later, Chen went to the capital city. He also brought this art to the capital. Since then, sugar painting became a lasting craft. In the 17th century, sugar painting became more popular, and the production techniques were more sophisticated. The objects include flowers and birds, fortune symbols, and 12 zodiac signs in other designs. <laughs> the art of sugar painting combines food, cultural, and handicraft, both ornamental and edible. The painting is done in one go, without any draft. Today's sugar painting is more creative in forms. Cartoon sugar painting, 3D sugar painting, are bringing new life to traditional ones. The culture of China, the spirit of sugar painting, have been passed on through the sugar spoons of generations of craftsmen.